Artificial intelligence is poised to be a major driver of innovation and growth for a wide range of industries. Here we'll look at the best AI ETFs. So why AI? Artificial intelligence, or AI for short as the name suggests, refers to systems designed to mimic the human brain. The term broadly applies to synthetic intelligence, learning, reasoning, and problem solving. While AI is often associated with robots, usually ones that resemble human form, it is already used in many machines at a much smaller level across a wide variety of industries. Think task execution, recursive algorithms that self-optimize, and machine learning inside computers and on assembly lines. Artificial intelligence is based on the premise that the human brain can be replicated to a degree in terms of its ability to think, improve, reason, and solve problems. AI systems can be simple or complex, depending on the intended application, and are usually based around algorithms. Think of IBM's Watson and its ability to diagnose disease based on symptoms being input and then prescribed treatment. Other examples include self-driving cars, computers that play chess, and Apple's famous personal assistant, Siri. Artificial intelligence is constantly evolving and improving, and is already benefiting many industries including tech, telecommunication, finance, psychology, medicine, manufacturing, computer science, and more. At any level in any industry, AI is poised to be a major disruptive technology and will likely provide a massive boost to productivity, thereby lowering costs and improving profitability. The problem for investors seeking to go long on artificial intelligence is the fact that many pure AI and robotics stocks are small, volatile, foreign companies at risk of going under before their technology is brought to market. ETFs solve that problem, providing a basket of stocks to diversify exposure across the industry, thereby reducing single company risk. Here we'll explore the best artificial intelligence ETFs. First on the list is QQQ, the Invesco QQQ. This is the famous ETF that tracks the NASDAQ 100 index. But what's this broad index fund doing on a list for artificial intelligence ETFs? Simply put, the NASDAQ 100 is basically a tech fund at this point. Most of its holdings fall in the technology and newly created telecommunications sectors. While it's not a pure AI play by any means, you get heavy exposure to all the major players involved in artificial intelligence that are household names, both the designers or producers and the beneficiaries. Think Apple, Google, Microsoft, Facebook, Amazon, Tesla, Nvidia, Adobe, Intel, Netflix, Qualcomm, AMD, etc. This makes QQQ a sustainable tech and AI play for those who want to stay in US listed large caps without dealing with small, volatile Japanese companies. QQQ is extremely popular with over $125 billion in assets. This ETF has an expense ratio of 0.20%. I also explained elsewhere that it's got a younger brother, QQQM, that tracks the same index and is cheaper. Next on our list is VGT, the Vanguard Information Technology ETF. VGT is slightly narrower than QQQ. It focuses solely on tech stocks, excluding things like healthcare that QQQ has some exposure to. VGT also excludes telecommunications though, so you won't find Google, Facebook, Netflix, etc. in here. This ETF puts the spotlight more on pure tech large caps like Apple, Microsoft, Nvidia, Adobe, Intel, and more. This ETF has over $43 billion in assets, 328 holdings, and an expense ratio of 0.10%. Third on our list is BOTZ, or BOTS, the Global X Robotics and Artificial Intelligence ETF. BOTS provides more targeted exposure for a pure AI and robotics play. The fund seeks to track the index global robotics and artificial intelligence thematic index, a market cap weighted index of tech and industrial stocks involved in artificial intelligence and robotics from developed countries. The fund is concentrated heavily in Japan at 42%, the United States at 34%, and Switzerland at 14%, and tilts towards small caps at 29%, and mid caps at 13%. While the ETF is very concentrated with only 32 holdings and is relatively expensive. With an expense ratio of 0.68%, BOTZ is great for investors wanting narrow access to companies with explicitly stated business interests in AI and robotics. This ETF is pretty popular with over $1.7 billion in assets. Next on our list is ROBO or ROBO, the Robo Global Robotics and Automation Index ETF. This ETF is very similar to BOTZ in scope but has fewer large cap stocks in favor of more mid cap focus. ROBO also has a higher number of holdings at 89 and has thus been less volatile than BOTZ. The fund seeks to track the Robo Global Robotics and Automation Index, an equal weighted index comprised of US and international stocks in both developed and emerging markets that provide devices or sensors for any types of robotics and artificial intelligence. Unlike BOTZ, Robo is heavily concentrated in the US at 50 
50% and also includes emerging markets like Taiwan and China. Robo is less popular than bots with $1.2 billion in assets and is more expensive with an expense ratio of 0.95%. Also, unlike bots, most of the top 10 holdings in Robo are not going to be household names. Investors seeking smaller, volatile foreign companies may prefer Robo over bots. Next on our list is ARKQ or ARK. Q, the ARC Autonomous Technology and Robotics ETF. This is a pretty popular active managed ETF from ARC Funds run by Kathy Wood. ARKQ aims to identify companies that will benefit the most from automation and artificial intelligence. Specifically, the fund's managers are interested in things like autonomous driving, 3D printing, automation, and energy storage. Because of this, the fund includes obvious names like Apple, Nvidia, Amazon, and Tesla, but also has industrial players like John Deere and Caterpillar. This ETF is heavily focused in the United States at 83%, followed by Hong Kong at 5%, Japan at 2%, and China at 2%. It has much lower liquidity than the earlier ETFs, with only about $600 million in assets. This fund has an expense ratio of 0.75%. Next on our list is IRBO, or ERBO, the iShares Robotics and Artificial Intelligence Multi-Sector ETF. IRBO is one of the newer AI ETFs on the scene in accepted in June of 2018. It happens to be by far the most affordable fund on this list with an expense ratio of 0.47%. The fund seeks to track the NYSE Fact Set Global Robotics and Artificial Intelligence Index, an equal weighted index comprised of companies from around the world involved in robotics and artificial intelligence. This ETF could also be considered more diversified with 103 holdings spread more evenly geographically. Exposure includes the United States at 56%, Japan at 10%, Hong Kong at 8%, China at 7%, Korea at 4%, France at 4%, Taiwan at 3%, and others. Top holdings include Pinterest, LG, Yandex, AMD, and more. No individual holding makes up more than 2% of the fund. The top 10 holdings only make up 14% of the total fund. What do you think of the AI sector and these AI ETFs? Do you plan on buying any? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.